Mouth Wednesday. Happy people! Yeah, yeah, yeah! Okay, so now there's so much online because of Docu Series Surviving R. Kelly. People are now saying, you know what, I'm gonna stop listening to R. Kelly's music. I hate R. Kelly. R. Kelly's a bad person. And guys, guys, come on, think about this. We all saw the signs over the years. There have been so many allegations as regards R. Kelly mistreating women. Um, you know, being in underage women and all that, and nobody did anything. And now, well, of course, a lot of things were done, but I don't know how he found his way to, you know, wriggle out of all those. But check this out. Now, we got docu series. We all want to go crazy. You know what? I am still going to listen to R. Kelly's songs. I grew up listening to this guy. And this guy gave us gospel songs, gave us love songs that we still dance to till today. And he gave us, you know, songs that we we can't forget that when we sing those songs, we remember the very beautiful woman that we love, you know, from the likes of Step in the Name of Love. And gave us God songs like um, Angel, gave us Storm is Over. People kabash Storm is Over. Like people use that song to lead praise and worship in church. And next thing you hear that this guy has a very sick very sick past and a sick habit of sleeping with underage girls. Okay, when I listen to happy people or step in the name of love, I am definitely not thinking about R. Kelly being a pedophile or molesting women or, you know, just holding women. Nah, I'm not thinking about that. But will I stop listening to the music? When it comes on, I'm not saying I'm gonna like source for his music, but when it comes on, I will listen to it and dance to it. But I'll say one thing, he's disgusting and he's, some, he's someone that I think should go to prison, like, you know, go to prison for the rest of his life because, um, I mean, it's terrible. Yeah, because I am going to say, happy people, I'm talking about myself, I am happy, I keep the world in. <laughs> That's what it is for me, man. Bad Mouth Wednesday.